Hello everybody, welcome back to Euro Truck Simulator 2. Today, what are we doing? Um, we're going to drive some more. Um, should I show you where we are? We're in Budapest, Hungary. I drove down here because I can. Okay, they're broke. That's not broke. But it's also boring. I want to see if we can... I'll travel to there, and then we'll travel back. That's how it works, right? Right there. We'll probably get over a million in the bank. I will spend that on... And then map, and then Hungary, and go back. We actually don't have a million. Oh well. Freight market. Budapest. That place we need to go to. And there's nothing going there again. Yay! Oh, um, okay, we'll go there. Anything going down to. There is! I doubt it'll be there when we get... Oh my god. Okay, map. There. Okay, we have a million. Okay. <laughs> What's that? Depression. Yeah, I just can't believe it. Right. Here's the thing, we'll try and sleep. There we go. And... There's still nothing going there. <sighs> That's a lot to go there for. Wow. Right, let's try it again. Sleep. If I just could go down there, then I can get that out of the way. I never have to go there again. If I don't want to. Whoa! There's something going to Budapest. Okay. Can we sleep again? Yeah, we can. Just one more time. Um. What's it called? Depression. I can't pronounce that. I, I do apologise. Wow, it's a, like rail industry, a large here. <sighs> Let's go to Hungary. I'm hungry for Hungary. Okay. Ah! Guess where we're going? And we never have to go there again. Parking brake is engaged. Whoa, careful! Try and get around you. Uh, oh no, they lights. What do Daddy bought? 
That, oh shit. That video on Facebook. Whoa, what's this? Okay. Because I want to go there and then we can get it out of the way. It's like one of those cities where it's just tucked away in the corner. It's like, there's no other cities around it. So, chances are, we'll probably just go further away from it. So, there's... You might as well just get there, get it out of the way. Ow. And then, yeah. Shell. Hundred and thirty mile. Not bad. Oh my f things aren't on. There we go. Oh, that's better. Sorry. Get out of here. What's this guy carrying in his truck? I believe this is um like live animals. How heavy is this? 21 ton. Uh, it might be pigeons. I'm. I'm not even being funny. I think it might be pigeons. With how those little boxes are there. As if it was like pigs. Or oh, cattle. Whatever. Um. Oh, thank you for waiting. There's a scan your driver. That's why. Um. If it was pigs. It would have like the big gaps, like kind of large gaps, because obviously pigs are quite big animals. They're not going to get through the gaps. Pigeons are birds that could fit through tiny gaps, so they have boxes and fans for ventilation. You can feel where the road joined then. See, that was something out of 1.9. Be because before, they'd just pull out, they they wouldn't care. I mean, they still do, but I think that they're meant to. Well, they were meant to before, but... There's like a thing now, so, like, drivers will have aggression. Or s some AI cars will have aggression. See, if you wondered how I got to Budapest, or did I tell you this? I won't tell you again anyway. I drove down there, I've been doing a lot of off screen driving. Just trying to g discover some of the cities, just purchase some garages, then just get them out of the way, get them done with. The roads are empty at half past four in the morning. Yeah, 
This is nice. So what have I been doing? Um, because you probably don't want to know, but you're going to know anyway. Um, I've been out all day because sunny weather, holidays, well, holidays for oh, like a week. I don't know. And I've got sunburn already. It's like, it's spring. It's not like intense heat. It's about, it's about, it's getting up in the 20s. It's got to be. And I've burnt my arms are really hurting. And the back of my neck is stinging. When it comes to sun, and I apologise if there is anybody out there that is ginger, but I burn like a ginger. Because ginger people are generally known to have really pale skin and they burn really easily. Though there is people in my family that are ginger. My dad, for example. It, well, was. It, like, it changed as he aged. Um, and yeah, so I just burn like that. I have really pale skin. And it hurts. <laughs> It'd be worse in the morning, though. Bearing in mind I record this on a Wednesday, so... Yeah. So Thursday morning, it is going... It, my skin's just going to tight, so it's going to shrivel up. And that'll be when it hurts the most. Any... Stubborn trucks here? No, okay. Scan here again. See, scan you, hauling that. I've had this debate before. What trucks are made for heavy haulage? And I think it's Volvo. Well, I'd like it to be Scania because Scania, to me, is the best. They're really nice. But, I think it's Volvo. Every time I see a Volvo, that, or something, no, it's rephrase that. Every time I see something like heavy th object being hauled, it is usually by a Volvo FH16. Shit. And it usually has the triple axle on the back. Now I don't know if that's just you know, by chance that they're using Volvo or if it's because they're built better for it. They have more power. I really don't know. In fact, I'm going to settle this once and for all. What have we got in this? 620. Okay. Volvo. Just a buy online. Here we are. Uh, there is a. Hmm. I wonder if you can get the. I'm doing this, I really don't know. Oh, whoa. So there you go. Wow, looks a bit dip. Just cancel all that. Wait, what? Oh yes, sorry. <laughs> so yeah, 750 horsepower, that might be why then. 
But I think you can get a 730 horsepower in the Scania. I don't know really. Oh, we're really pounding the tarmac, right? Um, let's pull into this lane. What time do they expect us for? Five twenty-four. Oh, so we're in the expecting time. Oh, I've got hours. The ETA is half six. Not a problem. What else has been happening? Oh, let's build. I don't know if you guys watch it, um, but I suggest you do. I mean, I've really liked enjoy doing. I've, I really liked it. I really enjoyed doing it this time because of it being third person, and I've set myself a target, and basically it is to be non-symmetrical. Or the idea of if you cut it in half, it wouldn't be the same on either side. That's symmetrical, yeah. Because last time it was it was it was bang on symmetrical. Anywhere you cut it, if you cut it half, you know, you cut it straight down the middle, it would be the same. And I didn't like that. I thought it it was too boring. And we've been first person. It was hard to watch. But this time, yeah. And I have the power of editing. I have be better edit editing software now, so I can put edits on it if I really need to. I mean, I edit it any anyway. Whoa! Oh my god! Oh my god! Son of a gun! Right. Damage the trailer again. That's the AI fear. They just stop suddenly. Oh, shut up. Oh no! Drive forward, you maniac! Don't care what the lights say. I'm going. It's a bit chaos with all the cars there. Whoa, lag! Whoa. Okay, calm down. Oh my god! The brakes are absolutely useless! Oh, parking brakes engaged! What are you waiting for, Looney Tune? Proper idiot. CB. Just spin the truck around. Oh, 
Whoa! I'm gonna be able to recover that. That's better. Go. Good work. Yay. Okay, is there a garage here? Yeah, it is. Um, we just need to travel down there. I'll drive. On the curb! Ah! Wow, that actually didn't damage the truck. Come on! Whoa, slow down, Volvo. Oh my god. See, so if I ever want to come here, I can. Chances are of that, very slim. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching this episode of Euro Truck Simulator 2. Oh my god, I've just remembered. I forgot to drive the man. Look, you're going to have to remind me. I will do it, I promise. Anyway, thank you for watching. Please like, favourite and subscribe. And I will see you next time. ta -ra.